great shot. Hey guys, I'm Frank Doroff. I'm the writer of the best-selling book, Mastering the Model Shoot. Now, during my workshops, I get a lot of questions about people. What about raw developing? How to set my camera? Do I need Adobe RGB? Do I need, do I need sRGB? There are many questions out there. And the best thing to start with is use Lightroom and Adobe Photoshop. That's where you start. But after that, if you want a little bit more quality, if you shoot a lot of tethered setups, Capture One is actually one of the best programs out there. It isn't the best in library modes. It isn't the best in map modes. That's where we still use Lightroom. But Capture One is an awesome RAW developer. Now, what is a RAW developer and why is it important? Think about the old days when we had film. The choice of chemicals and the choice of film made a huge difference. The same film developed in different chemicals gave you totally different end result. The model was still the model, the landscape was still the same landscape, but you get more definition from one chemical. Or you get a little bit more detail or a little bit different colors, also depending on the process. And that actually is the same thing for the new digital sensors. A digital sensor records a raw image. There's no color space attached to a raw image, it's the raw image. You have to attach a color space yourself. This is also one of the most heard problems during, for example, social media stuff. How do I set my camera? If you shoot JPEG, choose sRGB or Adobe RGB. If you shoot RAW, it doesn't matter because the RAW file is the RAW file. There's no color profile attached. That's what you do in your RAW converter as soon as you go to JPEG or TIFF. And most workflows, of course, will be TIFF 16 bits because then you have a lot of stuff to work with and then you can use the bigger color spaces. But hey, I'm getting way ahead of the stuff. I don't want to teach you too much because this is a promo for a new video I created. Now, next to Lightroom, one of the most famous and best known RAW developers is, of course, Capture One. And Capture One has had a turbulent experience for me. It started when I shot medium format, I needed Capture One. And now when I shoot Sony and even when I shot Canon, I quickly found out that the raw developing of Capture One was awesome. But a lot of people have a lot of questions about how does it work? With Lightroom, I know how everything works, but how does it work in Capture One? And that's why we created this video for you guys. It's a total walkthrough about how I set up Capture One to work with Lightroom and Adobe Photoshop because those are still my main programs. Capture One is used for raw developing and it does such an amazing job at that. So, check out the video on Capture One Raw Developing Workflow from me, Frank Doroff. And I'm sure if you have any questions about Capture One, they will be answered in that video. Mm -hmm.